100.9 The Eagle with Jamie and Morgan in the mornings. Classic hits all day. Under point nine, the Eagle has a chance for you to win a very nice Christmas present. We have details coming up right after Thanksgiving on the Eagle. Radio these days still rocks, but jocks like Jamie Carr of the Eagle have seen changes in the industry. In a modern day station, there is not a turntable or a tape machine of any kind, and it's all off the hard drive. Across the hall at KGNC, the Texas Panhandle Association of Broadcasters has a small museum honoring the pioneers of broadcasting in our area. In the late 60s and the early 70s, radio stations exploded just like they have here where you've got 28 or 30 stations per town. In those days, uh, those guys in the 60s were stars, big stars. Especially in Los Angeles. Meet Reb Foster. The Amarillo High graduate worked at KLYN, which later became KIXZ in Amarillo. And after working around the country, he landed in L.A. Carol A. Uh, began following and it was a very early time. And Bobby Banks knew uh, a girl at William Morris. They were very good friends. So I got an idea one day. I said, why don't Bob and I go through Donna and uh, see if we can promote them? the Beatles concert in Los Angeles. And we got the contract and we promoted them to the Hollywood Bowl. Of course, we include KRLA because that's where we work. And uh, people think we made a fortune. We made a, a grand profit of $4,000. The Rolling Stones, Frank Sinatra, and a who's who of 60s music, Reb Foster worked with them all. And when I Open the mic the first time at Carol A. Uh, I was very proud of myself and felt fulfilled. I said, "Hi, this is my first night in L.A. and boy, am I feeling good." But it would have been it would have been great the freedom that the uh, that the jocks had uh, uh, to play what they wanted. You were a superhero. <laughs> well, I had someone tell me, "Hey, you know who that was? It just told you you were good." and I had no idea and they said well Google him and I did and I stayed up till four o'clock in the morning. I can tell you in four years I enjoy every moment I get to spend with him. Celebrating the Panhandle Spirit, Larry Lemons, ABC 7 News.